or just on the phone. Just Hi, this is Jocelyn. I'm back with another look. This one is called. Okay. It has a really nice line, and I just push it out. And sometimes you know how it overheats out. If you push it out, and it's it's, it's quite hard. I just let it sit. So this one's a little bit soft, but I'm gonna bed, so I just don't want to not do this one. Okay, this is a very this is a special one actually. Um, I made sesame oil. This black sesame oil. Uh, so. And for some reason, we all loved it, and I never made it again. Um, and we're down to one bar, and I think that's ridiculous. I make so all the time, so why don't I make this? So this is sesame. It's got um, this essential oil. It's called um, Float Away. It's, it's really nice. Um, I just hope the swirls are nice. Okay, it's kind of soft, but... It's going through very easily. Ah, okay. Let me not drop this one. Okay, so my son's going to help me to record. So he'll have to come the other side. And as I point into how it looks like. Um, okay, and I'll take the mouse and you can have a look. Okay, let's have a look together. Oh, it started to gel. Oh, it's a good thing I cut it now. Uh, yeah, that's quite interesting. Hmm. I think it'll change to a lighter color maybe tomorrow. Oh, who knows? Oh, it has gelled. I was afraid it would gel. I've been having... I don't know, for some reason when my soap gel on me and I pop them in the oven, it comes out different. Different like it's um, it's not as hard, it's a bit spongy, it takes longer to to dry out. I don't know why. That's just one of those things I guess. So I'm trying to keep everything cold. Oh, let me see. Okay, so Okay, this one turned out much better than the other one. So I'm going to finish cutting this one. Okay. I don't know if it... I have an end bit. Okay. So yeah, I've had... When I made the soap, I had a... I have a friend who's uh Who loves it. And... Strangely enough... The, the original recipe has black pepper, and I made this for my husband because he loves the sun, and I, I thought the black pepper would help him with, you know, the the muscle ache and all that, and the sports he does. Uh, but my friend found that it removes rashes and spots on her, so like uh, you know, she has a, a breakout or something, and she uses it, and in three days it's all gone, and and if it's a mosquito bite, it's gone the next day, so. <laughs> Uh, it seems only ridiculous that I don't make this, since it worked so well um, for her. This is not the original recipe. I've increased the uh, sesame, thinking more is best. But I will make another bar, that's another loaf that is the original, original recipe. This one has, I think, 20%. The other one has 15 Well, oh, yeah, maybe it has a bit more. I'm not sure. Okay. Show people how it looks like. Yeah. Okay, that's oh, that's a long four minutes. Okay, so this is the other way it goes. So this is this is my float away. Uh, I'm preparing these for Christmas. I know. I know Christmas is just going to sneak up on me, and then I'm not ready. <laughs> so thank you very much for watching. And let me see. I wanted to say something. Oh, never mind. They'll come back to me. Oh, and this is the other one that you um, saw earlier. This is the lemongrass, mechang, and uh, grapefruit lime. Sort of a light, very light note. Oh, it's a very nice... It's actually more uh, citrusy. Um, I put a lot of um, 
I love Glass of Mei Chang, but I can't seem to get that fragrance. I can't seem to suck that fragrance out. Anyway, I'm a little bit disappointed here, but I'm quite happy with this. Thank you for watching.